In 2021, this year, the President of the Republic of Indonesia, His Excellency Bapak Joko Widodo, has been mandated PKKB in to lead the stunting reduction program in Indonesia. Extraordinary actions also need to be taken. It is not only to achieve the target, but it will determine the quality of Indonesian human resources in the future. So uh, for indirect uh, cause of uh, stunting, we need uh, to improve uh, the provision of drinking water supplement, supplement uh, and sanitation, and then uh, to improve access and quality of nutrition, health and services, and then uh, to increase awareness, commitment and parenting practice and nutrition for mother and child. It is my hope uh, that uh, today this class will provide to uh, new information and fresh insight to the issues and explore the possible avenue for partnership between PKKP and, and the Embassy of the Kingdom uh, of Netherlands. The stunting is, is, is a health issue. It has to deal with health systems, and I will come back to that later on. But it is also a social issue. It is a behavioral issue. It has to do with behavior. And it is even a political issue. Now, actually, I want to take a, make a comparison with stunting as a multi headed monster. Basically, it targets on, on a number of, of three or four issues food and nutrition. And the second is the role of the young mother. Third is access to information and access to family planning. And the fourth is uh, health systems. The Netherlands is one of the leading countries, I think, in the health technology, knowledge on integrated health care solution. This provides a great potential to promote innovative partnership in the health sector with Indonesia, including the health intervention needed to address stunting. As a center of innovation in SRHR and SGBV, we try as much as possible to eliminate and reduce stunting cases with our perspective and best expertise. Thus, we focus more on child marriage as one of the factors of stunting and the family planning issues around it. The Dutch government has made significant um, financial commitment in contributing to child marriage prevention and elimination in Indonesia and some other countries. Power to Youth and the previously Yes I Do program are two examples of the Dutch government's contribution to uh, to the issues as mentioned earlier. Jadi dua persoalan terkait tentang stunting dan prevention yang menjadi panggung hangat kita dan juga bagi panggung kaum muda untuk mentransfer knowledge tentang prevensi anak dan dampaknya adalah stunting gitu. Jika dua soal ini usai so it's Imodium is proven to be effective uh, in improving infant and young child uh, feeding uh, practices. Uh, Imodium are also adaptable approach and enrich monthly growing monitoring session in Poshandu because it's uh, combined with the Poshandu activities every month, uh, despite the various uh, local cultures and languages. And Imo Demo module has been yeah, integrated also into several government programs and guidelines and teaching materials in the main university. UVID also educates adults, especially women, about the necessary nutrition before pregnancy. As we saw before as well, that women who lack macro and micronutrients increases the risk of low birth weight babies, which contributes to something. <laughs>